So right here, I joined a game. Username is literally grinding away. I actually joined username's game here. That's actually really funny. All right, guys, welcome back to a brand new Roblox Java video. My name is Creek, and in this video, guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can level up super fast to get to max level, level 50, as both a criminal and cop in the new Roblox Jailbreak Season 2 update. Now, before we get into this, I do want to show you guys that obviously I know what I'm talking about, so I'm going to go ahead and grab this vehicle here, and let's just take a look at all the new skins you get as a part of Season 2. So these are the skins here you get for your cars. No new vehicles this time, just skins. So you got the wavy skin here. Very, very nice. It's kind of like an ocean skin and i'm not going to spend too much time on these but i do want to show these off we have the lightning skin here the seeding skin we have the earth skin which looks pretty cool we got like the planet there on the car the hot dog skin here which is literally just a hot dog with mustard no ketchup but a hot dog with mustard we got the tiger creek craft skin with lo which looks super super cool really big fan of that obviously the my username is this bacon skin going on there we've also got the napkin nate skin which also looks really really good the money bag skin we've got the orange pixel which is the level 50 reward for hitting uh you know a level 50 on the criminal team and then we have the blue pixel skin which is the level 50 reward for hitting level 50 on the police team so these are the ultimate goals here or the ultimate rewards the orange pixel and the blue pixel really big fan of the orange one looks super cool and i'm going to show you guys how to get that really fast in this video all right so the first thing let's go over is cops how do you get to cops level 50 really fast well the easiest way to do this guys is to simply click the play button go on a random server and literally become a cop and just arrest everyone you can possibly see and i'm going to show you guys how to do it so right here i joined a game username is literally grinding away i actually joined username's game here that's actually really funny but uh, what you're going to do you're going to be a police officer and then all you're going to do is you're going to go and arrest everyone you possibly can something i recommend doing is simply going over here and grabbing the awesome huge military helicopter that's going to allow you to fly around the map really really fast and just get around super super easily and what you want to do is once you're in this server you want to go and literally go into the city and just arrest as many people as you possibly can all right so here's a guy right here i'm literally just going to land right on top of him this server's a little bit laggy should be fine though just going to go ahead and arrest this guy right here going to give us a little bit of experience right there there's a guy right here as well that's trying to uh, get us with the mini uzi i'm going to go ahead and arrest him he's actually pretty laggy there we go right there there's a dude right here let's go and arrest him as well bada bing bada boom just like that and you want to go around and arrest as many people as you can and then once you've arrested everyone in the server what you're going to do is you're going to go back to the server list and you're going to do the same thing again you're just going to join a random new server make sure it's one with a lot of criminals and then you're just going to repeat that process so basically join a server arrest everyone leave join a server arrest everyone leave like here we go on this server right here we got a bunch of criminals so i'm just going to become a police officer i'm gonna run up there get a helicopter and literally just go arrest them all and just repeat the process over and over and over again all right so i've got a helicopter we're just gonna do the same thing and we're gonna go into the city find as many criminals as we possibly can as you can see there's a lot here on the board a few of these guys actually have quite a bit of money i think there's uh usually quite a bit of people around the jewelry store all right there's a guy right here running i think it's actually a girl we're just gonna jump out and arrest her and there we go we'll hop back into our helicopter and just keep on going all right here we are at the train there's a few people here as well including this guy right here which has so much money there we go we're gonna go ahead and arrest him oh man he's probably not too happy about that apparently there's like hackers on the server auto robbers or something that's interesting I'm going to arrest this guy I'm going to arrest this guy right here too there we go perfect three thousand dollar bounty that's actually pretty big oh my gosh and then we're gonna get up here and arrest this guy and like right there that's already a few levels right there literally right there we've already gotten a few levels right off of that we can go right in here this guy jumped down we're gonna jump right on in here if i can it's being a little bit laggy i can't actually get up there that's really weird maybe there are hackers in the server that's a little strange that's a little strange maybe, maybe there is hackers it's so weird anyway once we finish robbing uh or robbing once we finish arresting everyone in this server we're just gonna go and do the exact same thing go find another server click the join button and just repeat the process and that's basically how you get to max level really fast as a police officer now let's talk about the prisoner side of things okay now when it comes to the prisoner side there's a few things you need to know all right first off and this also goes for vip servers but you don't get as much xp in vip servers as you do in public servers you get half the amount
amount of XP. So this will not work in VIP servers. You need to be in a public server. What I recommend doing is downloading the add-on for Chrome called Roblox Plus. And what it will allow you to do is uh, have these arrows right here at the bottom of the screen that lets you sort through a bunch of servers. And right here you can see there's a bunch of servers with not a lot of players in them. So I'm going to go ahead and just join one of these. And obviously I'm a YouTuber, so a bunch of people are going to start joining in. But as you know, a normal user, you won't have a bunch of people join in. You can play around with only two people in the server. And this way you're getting the max XP benefits as well as not having to worry about any hackers or any cops or anything like that. Now, something else to note real quick when it comes to getting XP, okay? You do get about, I think it's like five to 10 experience from actually oofing cops. Not a lot, so it's not really worth grinding that. And you also don't get any experience at all from robbing the small stores. So if I go in here and rob Bad CC, it's not gonna give us any experience. So give it, it'll give us the $1,800, but it's not gonna give us any experience at all. So I'm gonna go ahead, hold E right here on the cash register, rob Bad CC. And as you can see, we're gonna get no XP from that. You only get experience from robbing the train, uh, the passenger train or the cargo train, the jewelry store, the bank, and uh, I do believe supply cases as well. You also get money uh, and XP from supply cases. Now, if you have a lot of Robux, what you can do is literally just keep buying supply cases over and over again and just keep robbing those because you do get a, a significant amount of XP from uh, getting supply cases. And in order to do that, all you gotta do is go to the server control room, go over here. I think it's like 25 Robux. It's actually 50, 50 Robux right here. And you can get 10 airdrops, which will get you up about a level, which that's about $1. IRL. If you have a dollar and you want to get up a few levels from that, you can. Otherwise, it, robbing the store is your best bet. Now, with the police, it's a lot easier because you can just server hop and stuff, but when it comes to the criminal, it's a lot harder. The only thing you can do is rob the bank right here. All right, and then you can come on over here and you can rob the jewelry store, and then you can also rob the two trains and the museum, but those are the only stores in the game that give you experience as a criminal, okay? Again, you do get a little bit of experience from actually just, you know, like oofing cops, but it's not a lot at all. So your best bet is to join a random server and then literally just rob the stores as they open up. Now, keep in mind, you don't have to get like a full load every time. So like if I were to go in the museum and just rob one thing and then get out, that would count as a full XP gathering. And then I would get all the XP from that. You don't have to rob it fully every single time. Now, just to show you guys what I mean by that, there's actually a cargo train right on over here. I'm going to show you guys on. Again, you don't have to rob everything. You just have to get a little bit of money and then you can get out so i'm just gonna jump right on up here we're gonna jump over here and we're gonna start robbing this thing i'm actually gonna wait until the train starts moving again otherwise it gets a little bit glitchy but i'll just wait right here until it starts moving okay so it's moving in i'm just gonna jump down here go in here now like i said you don't have to rob it fully literally just run in get a little bit of uh money there jump out and it's gonna give you the full amount of xp 150 xp you can see right there in the bottom right and that works for any of the stores in the game but yeah that's really about it for this video there's really not much else to show when it comes to getting XP as a police server hopping is your best bet just go on a server and you know arrest as many people as you possibly can and then when it comes to the criminal side of things obviously all you got to do is go around and rob the stores and that's pretty much your best bet unless you have a lot of Robux or you could of course just buy the levels too although I don't really recommend that and it's pretty much the only ways to level up but yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video hopefully it did help you guys out if it did be sure to subscribe and leave a comment down below tell me that it did help you out of course turn on your bell icon so that you're notified of all future uploads videos live streams everything we do here on the channel hit the like button on your out and uh, yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye